Hello dear friends, today is 27th June 2025 and today we have this 18,000 kVA oil immerse, oil immerse transformer in its final assembly. Uh, this is the uh, oil, oil pillow or it is used to store the extra oil when the temperature rises. You know, the when the temperature when the temperature rises, the oil enlarges its its size. The the transformer coil coil's windings has been placed into this tank. A few days ago, we manufactured a. 63,000 kVA transformer and uh, it is uh, almost uh, four times larger with regard to its rigid capacity. Okay now this is a this is a compact substation which will be used in a power solar power system project and uh, the dry type transformer that uh, we used we placed we w w which is placed inside is the one that we manufactured a uh, ago a few days ago which I recorded which was recorded by our YouTube sh shot videos shots I think it is YouTube shots. The video length is three minutes for the short videos. Let's have a close look at the name plate. Uh, it's SCB14. 14 is its energy efficiency mark and uh, 5500 and the higher voltage is 10 kV and uh, the lower voltage is 690 volts And uh, current transformers. We placed uh, three current transformers and uh, and six voltage transformers inside. The bus bars on the low voltage side is pretty is pretty strong, right? Because the current is very big. We need such wide and thick bus bar to bear the current. You see on the high voltage side, the bus bar is much smaller. Okay, let's go to take what's going on on other regions in our factory. Today, these are uh, Vacuum drying equipment is closed. I think uh, I think it is empty today. The factory is pretty big, and uh, over there is our switchgear assembly region. And ahead of us is is the hardware processing region, and here is our transformer 
transformer general assembly area. And uh, today we have quite a few small radiator capacity to all your transformer in assembly. Uh, these small ones, I think uh, the radiator capacity, the smallest one, I think uh, the radiator capacity is as around uh, 550. Let me have a look. It is uh it is one hundred and sixty. Yes, the the radiator capacity is is 160, 10 kV to 400 uh, volts. What is the energy? And uh, the energy efficiency level is S11. I think this is the lowest uh, energy level in China right now. If you if you want to know the accurate data of the of China's energy efficiency requirement, you can send me a message. You can check uh, at uh, the end of the video. There is our email, and uh, you also can check our channel to find our company name and our website name our website address and uh, then you can find our contact uh, method. Uh, one, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Twelve. Twelve plus, plus six It's eighteen. It's eighteen. It's eighteen sets of uh, 19. There is another one. There is another one. There are 18 in total. 116 kVA for your immersed transformer in production today. And uh, we still have uh, another quite a few dry top transformers in assembly today. Okay, thank you for your watching, dear friends. If you have any inquiry or any problems about uh, transformers, if there's any possible opportunities for us to cooperate, just send me a message, okay? At the end of our of this video, there is our contact uh, email. Admin at uh, zxtransformer.cn and you can also find our contact methods by check our channel introduction. There is our website and our telephone and our email. So thank you for your for your time and uh, greeting from Chengdu City. Greeting from Z ZX Transformer from Chengdu City. The capital city of Sichuan province and uh, the center city of, in the southwest of China. Have a nice day. Bye bye. See you in our next video.